What is up everybody? This is your host Superside and welcome back to another video of Heyday and in this video I'm going to be showing you a really cool uh, base like farm uh, base that's getting confused with Clash of Clans but a good cool farm design in this video and it's of Winnie the Pooh. It looks absolutely fantastic. It looks amazing and yes I know I don't normally do you know reviews of farms and that but this one is so legit. I'm like I gotta do a video of it and I was actually it was suggested in by the comments by a player of the, the name called Toots Blue Nose. So they commented, they didn't say do a video on it, they just said, oh, check it out, it looks real cool. And so anyway, I go check it out, I'm like, whoa, this looks legit! And so I'm gonna be doing a video, like, on it, like, just showing you this really, really cool farm. And yes, I know I don't normally do these kind of videos where I show farms off, because seeing different farms isn't really my thing, you know, that's, I, I, I'm more into, like, how do you make coins, how do you make diamonds, how do you get efficiency out of those diamonds, you know, how do you keep those production machines going, which production machines, what products you want to make, you know, I, I'm into that stuff, but occasionally, I'm just like, no, 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 you know what, you know what, I love, I actually like seeing a decent decorative farm, and so in this video, I'm going to be doing that, I'll just, just harvest a, oh, wow, wow, that was a bit shaky, just harvest a wee bit of these, and then we'll go visit them right now, and for those of you new to my channel, welcome, 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 and it is great to be here, okay, so there we go, we'll go through here, so yeah, shout out to Toots Blue Nose for letting me know of this, of this awesome farm, okay, so they are officially on the leaderboard, as, as, as they are, you know, as you always find, all the top players on the leaderboard, so they're down at 163 was what I thought it was, was it? It is indeed. So this player here, and 1.4 million leaderboard points on level 245. Let's go give them a visit. Let's go vi visit them, give them a cheeky wee look. So from, from this perspective, right, it looks it looks pretty normal. You know, it's your standard farm, you know, you, you got crops growing, you know, you got crops growing, and also they must have actively been playing, because when I visited earlier today, these were in one of the earlier stages, so there we go. And then they got real cool trees along here, and let's see their stats. Okay, 5,000, mate, look at those truck deliveries, 5,000, that is insane. Most player visits, 180,000, that is like, what? What? It's crazy. Max roadside shop, 4,444,444. Very, very impressive. And follow account of 44,570. So decent as, like super decent stats. Uh, and so like for me, it's like that. That's the player I'm looking for. That's a good player right there. Okay, anyway, 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 anyway. Let's go and check out this absolutely legit awesome looking farm. And it is officially... Oh my goodness gracious me, Winnie the Pooh, how cool is that? That is like legit, that is just such an awesome design. It's just like, they're so cool, that is just so cool. I just love that, I absolutely love that right there. Like, normally me and decorations just like, eh, just decorations, but it's like, when you, when you put those decorations together, when you pull them together, you can really create something. And this is what this player's done, they've actually, they've created Winnie the Pooh, and I just think, that is legit. That is a good looking, healthy looking, epic looking farm right there. Like, that is so cool. That is just so, so awesome. So we got Winnie the Pooh, and, and so there we go. We got his nice mouth smile, and, and just, you know, the different ingredients used to create this, right? So we come down here, and we've got all these sweet snails, who I didn't even know if they're coins or diamonds, but they must have cost a mint to get all those. And then, of course, you got all the roses. They cost coins, so I do know that much. I think that, yeah, I'm sure the coins, the roses. Roses in the tire. So we've got the roses in the tire, the snails in the you know, with the shells, we got the the pearl of the sea, where like a lot of pearl of the seas, like a lot of pearl of the seas. How do you even get that many pearl of the seas? It's like ridiculous. Like imagine how many mystery nets, and then that like half the time I've heard, most of the time you don't even get pearl of the sea. So like literally, they must have spent so many diamonds to get that, like so many. Anyway, as you can see right there, pearl of the sea, so many of them. So we've got the pearl of the sea. They've got a couple of chiggy ladybugs in there. Okay, so they're well, lady, a ladybird. Is it a ladybird or a ladybug? I, th I think it's a ladybug. Yes, yeah, definitely a ladybug. Okay, there we go. And so there we go. I'm confused. I don't know now. I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's a ladybug. Yeah, I'm sure it's a ladybug. I don't know. Anyway, okay, so the, and then we come in here, and it's just like, and then they got the tiles up here. Yeah, it's like, what? That looks so cool. That's so cool. And then, of course, I love these trees here. These are one of my favorite trees right there. It just looks so awesome, so colorful, so blue, so vibrant. I love it. I love seeing nice looking farms. And so, yeah, that is that. And then they got the animals over. They're just, no, yeah, well, like, you can only do so much with the animals, making them look good. But over here, that's just like, that's got to be one of my favorite farms I've ever seen in Heyday. That is, that is a solid, 
awesome, epic, amazing, incredibly, awesomely lookingly farm. Okay, I just said that really wrong, but hey, that that is that is cool. I love that right there. All right, do, do get. Let me know in the comments. Did you like that? Did you like that? that, that did you think that was awesome? I, I think that is so awesome. So yeah, that is that is the farm. I really wanted to show you. And then as you can see along here, they got all these anchors. I have never even seen their decoration, to the best of my knowledge, that I can remember. And all these these, these look so cool. This looks so awesome. I've, I've seen the rocking horse in that. Not my favorite decoration, but still, these here look cool. All these horseshoes again and again and again. And again. All the ones off the rocking horse, although they don't have shoes, they have like wooden curves. So it's that, and then of course we've got all the horse, I, I'm a, take it the horse fan? I'm not sure, I would presume so. And then of course they got all these cannons along here, which look really cool, they've got the trees like colourful, it's just like, oh this looks so cool, and then of course they've got like, you could have cake here, you could have like a, a party, you know, like a nice wee cake, you know, with some tea on the side, I like the tea, and so you know, you can buy those in the daily dirt for like, a few thousand coins, like for ten, but then they've got some nice drinks. You know, they got is that is that syrup? Is that syrup? Imagine if that was syrup. That reminds me of syrup. Like I'm assuming it's raro, but mm. anyway. And then of course you got some tulips and some lovely wee flowers there. It's just we got Easter eggs on a tree. I've never seen an Easter egg tree. Well, like I've seen I've seen like Easter egg trees in Hayday, but like an actual tree with Easter eggs. And then of course they got the silo, the barn. They got a dog and a chicken running around, and they got the dog and chicken statue. Which oh, of course they're part of the statue. Yeah, of course. Okay. And they look pretty legit as well. And then of course they've got the nice crops in here. And they've got them all in one big clump, which I like it. It's when it's all like patterned everywhere. It takes ages. It's inconvenient to harvest, whereas that's a nice easy harvest. And then I've got a whole heap of decorations here. They've got the pinata. We got this, which I never determined was that an owl or a fox or a dog. Or I, I don't know what it what it was. We we never Determined that okay. Uh, yes, or maybe maybe it was determined I just never heard the answer and then of course we've got all these other things along here Which look really cool although technically that that bouncy castle was proportionately extremely small like I mean like the truck is bigger than the bouncy castle and that's not a good sign if the truck's bigger than the bouncy castle and then they've got there right here this that cool decoration right there so this here this is a, this is a, this is the, this is the farm farm of the day this is the farm of the day i love this farm as you can see in here a whole lot more decorations which is really cool a cacti right there which is awesome also by the way like there there's uh, one of these cacti uh, and it produces these like fruits called the prickly pear and I, I i ate one one of these prickly pears so it's like a fruit off a cacti and i had one of these prickly pears for the first time ever like a month ago or less probably a couple of weeks ago and it was like it, it, it tasted interesting it was like i got prickle like it, it has these really nasty prickles on it and the prickles like got on my tongue one got stuck in my tongue and uh, the, you know, the prickles are not nice if you get you know there's not prickles let it literally in the fruit but there is on the skin and so if you, you're cutting off the skin right then some of those those prickles the really little fine ones get stuck you know on the knife when you go to cut it then they go on the fruit and then you eat the fruit and then and then these awful wee little prickly things you know just get stuck and it's like ah you know if they get in your hand and that but it was cool it's cool being able to try a prickly beer for the first time in my life i had wanted to try it for a few years now for like seven years or so and i finally got to try one and it, it tastes like it tastes it was a bit disappointing i thought it would taste a little bit nicer you know because it's like i i just like when i see a fruit i just uh, presume the best i'm like it's a fruit it must taste nice and so like when it, it wasn't it was all it was all right like it, but it certainly wasn't the thing that i'd like definitely go out, out of my way to get again especially since there's a risk of getting prickled but anyway we'll go through here and we'll we'll see what there is they could they could add that you know as a fruit tree they could add like prickly pears as as the fruit for, for a cacti that would be kind of funny but yeah the whole world, we got some weeding let's let's just but yeah so that that is that awesome farm right there i loved it it was this is such a cool farm right there so yeah i just thought i would show you that because I, I don't normally show off farms you know for their for their good looks because i don't normally consider farms like that good looking like you know i don't know like mine of course i admit is just look horrible it's, it's look like it's horrible enough like with at like it's just like with that it's just absolutely died it's just like that's just killed it but eventually we go well slowly there we go there we go that we're gonna six closer to getting it clean but this is gonna take a while like we'll get it but it's gonna take a while to slowly clear things up you know just a little few things in there which i kind of overplanted. well i did i i knew actively that that was gonna happen uh although i did harvest, i just well what ended up happening is i ended up doing that you know the harvest thing you know harvest like i don't know it was a couple of hundred of them you know for a video 
video, you know, it's like I did one of the blackberries and that just to look cool, but I didn't actually really want to harvest them all right then because otherwise I knew it would look like that, but it was cool to harvest them and then it's like, oh yeah, look at all, uh, you know, expend, you know, look at it, look at all these dead trees right now when they could all have fruit on them, you know, then it wouldn't look as bad, but now it looks terrible, but I still have to go, so yeah, my farm of all farms is like one of the worst farms in terms of looks, uh, but there's a lot of, a lot of reasonable looking farms, like I, it is cool seeing all the different designs, but then there are of course those exceptional ones, you know, the, the Winnie the Pooh farms, you know, that's my aspiration of a farm, although, sadly to do that, I would have to do the unthinkable, which would, oh, whoa, 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 would, it would involve, um, that, which is not going to be happening on my farm anytime soon, uh, but yes, that, that will be, hmm, I would like, you know, I gotta work out, I gotta think of innovative ideas that work around my existing trees, you know, how can I make it work, you know, without cutting down a single one, except the two I accidentally cut down, which I'm really sad about, except for those two, how can we make this look good? How can we, how can we spice up the farm? How can we snazz it up? So that will be something that I probably one day get round to. Like, I've got, see, I've got a little where we Christmas decoration, we point in there, and then, uh, where, where was the other thing? We got Heyday, there we go with the bicycle, which I really didn't want to buy that bicycle right there. This bee decoration, I'm, I'm really happy I got that. That was a real cool one to get. And then over here, this here, that right there, very, 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 very awesome right there. And as you can see, I've got a few decorations in here, that look like semi-legit, but then not like that legit, like not compared to some farms. But I said, this is one of my favorite trees right here, the, the Christmas one. And I don't normally speak about decorations, but this one is, a, this is one of my favorite decorations. I love this one. This Christmas tree is just like so cool. It's like this mini one, but all the sparkling lights around it and, and the star on top. It is, it is a legitimate. I, I like that one. And also this one here, Val that was Valentine's. What, that was, was that Valentine's 2017? I think it was like a year ago. Or maybe it was 18. I'm not sure. But as you can see, that one looks pretty cool. And then, of course, we got the cake. And then, uh, have we got... Oh, it's just a truck delivery event at the moment, which I'm probably not going to do. Um, the, uh, 10 diamonds. Mm, yeah, I'd have to do four trucks. And then, of course... Oh, we could do that. Yeah, we'll do that one there. Here we go. Well, well, one on the way. We just need another three. Okay, but I, I really need to get that and that to, in order to get it, which... Because I only like doing those ones. Yeah. Oh, wait, no. That's just to get the first threshold. That's not to get the 10 diamonds. I'm almost at 600 free-to-play diamonds because I've never spent any money uh, on any coins or diamonds and so I'm actually doing I I consider myself to be doing pretty well considering wait let's see let's see if, if we can blast a couple out of here if we're or, or not maybe maybe not okay never mind never mind it's uh, the drop rate is so oh there we go we got we got it there we go and so then we'll just need the one more in order to hit the 600 which I'll just do that there and it's not that one okay never mind um, I'll, wait, I'll just I'll just complete these right and then if we need some more we can Okay, we'll use that one up. Oh, yeah, I think we bought a whole heap. Yeah, okay, that will be that will be next video, or well, one video. You'll be able to see that I've, I've hit the 600, hopefully, after it. Remember when I spent, like, 50 diamonds on, like, oh, what was it? I can't even... Reindeer. It was a reindeer. I don't even know where I put the reindeer anymore. I spent... I, I don't even know where it is. I don't even... Oh, there it goes. There it goes. Yeah, I spent, like, 50 diamonds on that. Or was it 30? I don't know. Anyway, 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 that will wrap up this video. I do hope you enjoyed it. I don't normally show off, you know, the top farm, but I thought that is such a cool design, so I had to show that one off. Like, anyway. But, yeah, please give the video a like if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel, and thank you so, so much for all of you who already are subscribed. I really, really do appreciate it. So, thanks again. This has been your host, Supersight, and remember to make coins faster. Then honeybees make honey.